Okay, it's flight test time for the Matek F405 wing, no, F405 WSE. Mounted it up on the Trainstar Ascent. Uh, up here like this, there's the nice little external USB board. Uh, we've had a lot of rain, it's very wet, so I'm going to have to hand launch this, I think. And there's a fair bit of wind around, but anyway, it's never stopped us before. Camera, FPV camera mounted up on the tail there. <clears throat> I have flaps on a momentary switch. Uh, flick on, flick off, which is a nice little touch with a, about a one and a half second delay. All right, time to get it up flying. Ah, I see I have a safe home zero nearby, which is great. Here we go. So there we go, nice picture, seven satellites, that's not very many, usually have a lot more than that, uh, but oh, I've got a great view, uh, video filtering seems to be very good, you can see a lot of the water down there, um, acro mode directly above me there, so a bit rough, let's fly it there a little bit. Uh, this is one OSD screen, this is the OSD screen with the lot, artificial horizon, all that sort of stuff. I don't usually have this stuff on there, but I'm just doing it to show um, how much stuff you can fit on the screen, if you like that sort of stuff. Or you can go totally nude like that, which is very nice. Yeah, very nice indeed. Train star ascent camera mounted up on the on the tail oh, let's show you my flaps rises up a bit not too bad sorts itself out eventually a little bit more speed maybe stop it wallowing flick again and it comes down very cool See all the water down there. They would normally be playing cricket there, but uh, obviously not on that football oval, on that cricket oval. So it's behaving very well. No noise to speak of in the video feed, which is the main thing we're interested in from a flight control board, I think. Uh, all the normal INAV stabilisation seems to work okay, although I just fly around in manual or acro mode usually. So this is a very nice board, smaller than the F405 wing board, uh, with the breakout buzzer and USB-C connection and DFU button. And the buzzer can be turned off and on too, which is excellent. This 405 board doesn't have dual camera or camera switching. Uh, you'd have to go to an F722 or F411 board for that, or F765. Uh, but I still like the F405. Great board. And uh, has sufficient flash memory on it to load RD Pilot if you want to. Return to launch. Try a return to launch now. It should return to safe home point zero which is right about there. Loitering around home, there we go. That's nice. It's not going to uh, loiter around over my head which is too close to the um, road behind me. Bit of wind pushing the circle out. Love this safe home. Oh, look at the birds down there. Let's go and have a look at them. All these water birds, ibises, appear when uh, we get sort of flooding rain like this.
Very good. Okay, so that's a big thumbs up from me for the F405 WSE flight control board from Matic. Very nice indeed. Try and negotiate a landing. Flaps down. Yeah, I knew that was going to happen. Oh well. A bit hard in this soggy long grass. There you go, that's a good little flight control board. Uh, it could well become my go-to board, I think. Maytech F405 WSE board. Thanks for watching.